Hi guys, it's me, Nana. I've been awful busy and I haven't been able to do a haul and so I thought I'd stop in and say hello and hope that you like my newest DIY. I've been having so much fun doing it and I have so many other things coming down the pike. As they say, I have so many other uh, uh, projects that I'm working on. I hope you like this one. This one is one of my favorites and I thought I'd uh, just stop in and say hello and uh, let you know that I'm thinking about you and also to um, make a few shout outs. I wanted to say hi to Margie. I know you watch all the time and Cammy. Cammy, oh my gosh, she is one of the stars of Nana's uh, Crafters Co-op. It's Nana's Design Studio and Crafters Co-op on Facebook. Please come and join us. Cammie is actually one of our big stars. She is our greeting uh, host uh, hostess. She is just all those things. And Cammie, I wanted to tell you right here, right now, how much I appreciate you and how, um, how much I look forward to your crafts every week. Big shout out. Love you, girl. Okay, guys, enjoy the DIY, and I will be seeing you soon again, okay? Bye for now. So, the things I'm starting with are, of course, hello, my glue gun. I have a lot of extra glue sticks. Ta-da! Some really good scissors. I don't know how much I'll need them, but I have them always. And I have today the, well, these are the uh, candlesticks from Dollar Tree, and they are uh, this is actually the medium size, and this is the small one. So that's the ones I'm using today. I have, and I have two of these candle bases. You're just supposed to put a candle on top of the mirror. And I have two of the round ones, and then I have the small vase. This is actually a vase. It's not really a, a candlestick, but I got larger ones, so uh, taller candles, so I should be able to uh, use them without a problem. All right, I believe, oh, and the star of the show will be these beautiful acrylic gems. Oops, I already opened them. I was practicing. So I have these beautiful acrylic gems. And I went to Hobby Lobby in search of something to stabilize them because they do have, they're like gems, they're actual gems, right? Like a, like a crystal or a, what we call that, a white topaz, something like that. And they have that really pointy uh, end, see that? So I wanted something to stabilize it and I found these tchotchke type things. They use these for like jewelry making and it's $2.99, but I got it for 40% off with my 40% Hobby Lobby coupon. And I'm hoping that this will work as a stabilizer. See, it has a little hole there in the center for gems. So we're gonna kind of bling things up for Mother's Day. And let's get right to it. Okay guys, now I have these candlesticks. I forgot to tell you that in the beginning. Uh, these are approximately two and three quarters of an inch round. I got these at Hobby Lobby as well and they happen to be on 50% off. So, was really excited. It just so happens the time I needed candlesticks that will fit into our beautiful uh, glass vases from Dollar Tree was the day that I needed them. So I guess it's Mother's Day week and everything is on sale. All right. Now, first and foremost, I have my little hot glue gun. I have it on low uh, only because uh, I don't need it to be hot. I only put it on really high heat when I need it. Let's see it. I have this circle on my uh, mat 
and I can see where my diamond would be because I don't want to put four on this. I want to put a diamond shape, like a triangle. I want to put a triangle. So this is going to try to help me uh, do the right measurement. I like these because they have this flat area and I feel it's a lot more secure, but getting it to be secure here is another thing. My hot glue should be good. And you don't really need a lot. This stuff is pretty darn strong. And center that pretty darn well. See how quick that goes on? I mean, it goes on crazy quick. <laughs> there we go. And like I said, I want these in a triangle. And it butts right up against. There we go. That looks really good. Oh, I'm so happy. I really hoped, and I walked all around um, Dollar Tree. Let me see how I can get that to where you can actually see. Nope, that makes it further. <laughs> okay. There we go. That looks pretty good. That looks really, really good. That's going to give it some extra bling. And you know, for Mother's Day, I want some of that extra blingity bling bling. So doesn't take a lot again. And make sure it doesn't have those cobwebs. It gets right on there. Now I moved my position a little on purpose. i switch things off and clean that off in a little bit. And it actually looks like a flower. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh-oh, there it is. I missed the hole. There we go. Look at that. Oopsie. See that? Isn't that cool? Oh, my. <laughs> now, I also want to put some bling on the outside. Now, you see I have like a medallion here with the name, I want to put the bling right over that. So I want to make sure that it's standing the way I would have it when it's in, as close as I can get it to the center, right like that. Boom. Put this on. Right like that, right over the medallion. And I think there should be enough glue on there in the center to hold my crystal. Look at that! Oh my gosh, look at that. See, it's, it's really, really cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's exactly what I wanted. Oh, that is bling for Mama's Day. <laughs> Okay. And again, I'm going to put it on the top of the candlestick without being too close to the rim because um, I don't want it oozing out. And then I'm going to look dead center and measure it that way. Kind of bring it in. Boom! Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. Let me show you. When you look at it face front, whoopsie, see the medallion is right behind it. Oops, it becomes part of the decoration. Isn't that cool? Yay! Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do this again. I'm going to put it in the center.
Last one. I'm going to put that over just a tad. I'm not happy with the placement on that one. Put that over there, and I think enough scooched out from the bottom. Yep, to hold it in. Ladies, ladies and gentlemen alike, I give you this beautiful base. Isn't that nice? Just enough bling to play off the light when I turn on the light and put that up. Put it in, I kind of just hold the wick to let it gently go in. This one's gonna be a little more difficult maybe to eyeball by picking it up, so I'm gonna have to kind of hold it. Okay, so that has to be, I gotta eyeball it, make sure it's standing up. Put a little bit right there. I really love the bling. I understand there's a company online that uh, sells these kind of medallions for very inexpensive. I'm going to have to find out who that is because I am really starting to love the bling. And I put a little extra here because it's going to be standing up. Look at that. Oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Let's zoom out. Hi guys. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? And so simple and so elegant. I am in love. Let me take a few pictures of that and show you where and how I'm gonna have it, okay? Isn't that lovely? Oh, I'm so in love.